first week after release week of my new song need me and yes it's on all music streaming platforms thank you so much it's been a great experience we are at 4,000 streams on the song right now and that's just strictly through Spotify but I'm not sure about the other stream platforms but as far as releasing the song you know I'm just that song you know, I had it a little bit I had it you know over a year so I was like all right it's time to get this out and yes I'm here in my backyard my parents backyard <laughs> it's cold out a little frigid got my flannel on this is the first time you've seen my video my name is a Rai. I'm an independent musician graduated college in 2017 moved back with my family saw my first song the Sony records in 2019 now we're working towards moving out of my parents into my own house to do music full-time so with uh, releasing songs it's just like all right you just got to get it out don't think about it too much just get it out and that's been my overall process so other than that it's just like all right you can't just release a song what else do we got to do so with this I with this release I was like okay I've always felt like lyric videos are good so I did this kind of last minute but I made a lyric video for the song I wanted the cap cut. I used the free settings. I do pay for it, but I just use the free settings. That's all that sort of was necessary. But I I put everything together. I just changed the lyrics, what was needed. And then I used the cover art for the song, shaped it up into a YouTube thumbnail. And then I just used text to add into it that just fit, you know, the song overall. But yeah, I released it the day after the song, so I felt like it was a good idea because, hey, you know, I'm releasing a song on music streaming platforms. It's a good idea because people already know it's out. It's out. So I was like, all right, release a, mu a lyric video for it. Release the lyric video just to draw more uh, engagement with it, a better connection. Because whenever you see lyric videos, for me, for the most part, whenever I don't understand lyrics to a, a video or mu a, a song, when I see a lyric video helps me connect easier and then i end up remembering the lyrics and i'm like oh that's what that person is saying and it just makes it more fun because you know the lyrics you're not just guessing even though it can be fun to make up the lyrics but it's cool to know when you don't know the lyrics overall so i felt like that's good and i think any any anybody i know anybody releasing music as a musician that's definitely something to do incorporate lyrics videos it's easy to do. It takes you like 10 minutes to really whip it up, depending on like how, how intense you're getting into it. You can make different cuts and whatnot, but you just want to get those lyrics out there, and that's what's important. So that's what I did. That's what I'm doing. And you know, for, for future releases, I see that it being still prominent to be doing that. And yeah, just to get a different way for people to, to hear your music, because pe some people will listen to your music, but they're not hearing it. You know what I mean? So... Whenever you have those lyrics, <laughs> you can actually be like, oh, like they're actually saying something instead of just listening. They're actually hearing the words. So, you know, do that and, you know, spread it out. Make little story posts about it. Be like, hey, I got a lyric video out. You know, we got whatever, how many views. And give give your audience, your listeners, that that behind the scenes like yeah we have 200 views on this right now the goal is to get to this right now, uh this and just give them different like op op um different increments of time to be like all right we want to reach this goal and this we're going to get to the next goal so that's so how i look at it too with like releasing songs like okay overall goal is to get one million streams on all my songs whatever song it is just get one million streams combined per month on my music and that's that's just through uh, any music stream platform but that being said I'm gonna get to this in a little bit but after that releasing the lyric video you know I, I could give it some time you could wait some time but I feel like the, the day after it's pretty like hot you get, you get something out fresh give something out that's fresh you know but during those extra days, like the next day uh, of the release, just let it seep a little bit, like that lyric video. And you can wait a week, but I was just like, all right, let me just do this. And the day I released the song, I, I made the, the music video right in, the, in my house, at, like right here at my parents' house. And 
Like I've made it on CapCut. I edited on my, all on CapCut and I shot it on my phone. I recorded everything on my phone, directed my phone. And, you know, I just feel like anything you should do, if you can't do it, just do it yourself at this point, you know? So the music videos, you know, I've, I've released that two days after the song and I was like, it was kind of last minute thought. And <laughs> I just think music videos tell more of a story and it gives you a better feel of the song. You can get a mood for it, or you can just get a you know better experience. It doesn't matter like always the setting. It can just be like how your emotions are coming across in the song. So I see that being important when you're releasing music videos. But yeah, overall, like with that music video, we got to around almost 200 views. See, that's the thing too. Like I have it a goal set to where 200 goal 200 views is what I want to be met by the end of. Uh, this weekend, I think it was, or by the end of today. But either way, I make little like scripts about that. I post it on my stories, and I'll send it out into my like little discords and <laughs> chats and whatever, which is a great thing too. Just to have your discords built up with uh, your listeners, so they know what's going on. And I mean, that's great, you know, doing those music videos, lyric videos, but. Over time, you really want to, you know, make a living from your music and be able to, you know, take get some income because over time, like those 200 views, they know it's not much for a YouTube video. So, with your song, you really got to gather those those loyal people that are going to be listening to your music. You want those people that come come to you, whether or not Spotify Wrapped, Apple, whatever, the stats they're going to show you. Hey, you know, this person was listening to you. The most this person was listening to a ride throughout the whole year the most like be on t- people's top lists like that so you can be able to do this do the things you want because with those 10 loyal people that you're going to be growing with you can do it with other people too so that's my main focus right now is focusing on on those 10 loyal fans 20, 10 loyal supporters part of the a ride pack and that's the same thing you can do too so Say you got ten, you got ten fans. We got ten fans in the A-Rap Pack. Those ten fans are going to be streaming the music as much as they would, you know, a, a, a musician that's on their Spotify Wrapped or Apple Top Stats, whatever. So, picture two hundred and eight days max of streaming a song is one hundred thousand streams for one person. And with those 100,000 streams within those 10 people equates to 1 million streams for one song. And 1 million streams for a song generally is $2,000. But, I mean, it's it depends. Depends on what country and you know, what part of the nation you live in. But generally it's around $2,000. But that's what I'm saying. You could actually be making a living just from 10 people. 10 loyal people. And that's exactly what... I'm doing right now you could do it with your music too but that's the main focus here so if you're watching this you're one of those 10 loyal people I appreciate you doing that and being part of this because this is what really makes it happen that's the overall goal to get 1 million streams every single month throughout my songs and just not not be an issue because the streams it's very flimsy you have people like stream it here and there but you want to have those dominant streamers who are streaming your music you know, because they really want to be streaming it. It brings me to another point. Create playlists. You put yourself on other playlists with other musicians. I have a playlist with a bunch of musicians that I gather from TikTok. I gather them from X, that people that do uh, music NFTs. I separate the, the playlist that I do with one music NFT artist and his wife on X, too. It's like, you can submit your music for free as of now. The link is on my website, aripack.xyz, A-R-Y-E-P-A-C-K.xyz. And go down to music playlist and submit, submit your music for free. Submit just one song and I'll add it to the playlist. But this is a good way to just grow and for you to share the playlist. Be like, hey, I'm on a playlist with these other musicians that are on TikTok or on X or doing music NFTs. And it's just a good way for us to grow. But in general, too, with your own music, make, mu- make music playlists with your own music on it. So... I have my own playlist. It's called A Ride Bops, and I have that personal playlist, which is all my music, and I'll personalize it the way I wanted to. So I'll send that out to different, you know, people you listen to my music, and different people that I want to listen to my, that I want to introduce my music to. And this is a good way for you to stay in rotation instead of just 
click on your profile and then it just being kind of random even though it's it's random in the playlist but if you're organizing it the way you want it to then it's kind of flowing in a different sense where it's more appealing and good for you as a listener so you know if you are that person who's making a playlist too as a musician do that for yourself but overall yes those 10 people you can do that dominantly it just takes the 200 days by streaming over time and developing those relationships know that who the people you're working with know that they are here to grow with you and they understand that and that's the thing too like i would i had to learn i would put my music out in like right now i'm in the process of still finding those 10 people but like finding those people who are going to be prominent dominant and streaming and putting on a repeat and really helping this grow because just from those 10 people those 10 people can go to 10,000 people those 10,000 people you can go to 10 million people it's just it's just over time and every time someone's streaming something adding you're adding it to your playlist you're telling someone about it it's growing it just like a ripple effect one by one it's it's never not helping anything that's why i'm saying you can just start with 10 and then the algorithm sees that it just starts pushing you out into more so don't ever just think you can stay stagnant if you're a musician and you think you have to have you know a million people listen to your songs to be able to be doing anything you can start with just your 10 but yeah like i said this is a new strategy really i'm really applying it right now with my music you know i've been making tiktoks too about it and that's it. if you want to be able to find those people that are going to be the loyal people you got to start putting you got to start talking about it you got to start letting people know your metrics about where you want to reach your success and like i say i want to reach one million streams per month in and plus some one million streams per month is two thousand dollars and that's enough to make a living from your music and you're able to do that so take the time to put those videos out go on live streams and start building those relationships with people and let them know what like i said your metrics about what you're going through and what you want to reach with your your music but yeah just like be straight up because when you're not straight up about your music then people you know they see it from the outside but you want people like yourself who are really here and focused in on the tunnel vision of the overall process and goal of what the journey is you know aimed for and you know people who want to enjoy it and see this this process and be part of the process with you but overall yeah it was a great release it was fun doing a lyric video you know take the time do those lyric videos don't just put out the song put put out those lyric videos and then you can share different clips of the song with the lyric video on your social media and just reuse it and that's a good thing about lyric videos just in case you just want to break up the song in different sections to just share on your social media same thing with a music video you can just break up different parts of the music video or and then, and then put lyrics over the music video too to even just make it double wham you have the lyric video and a music video at the same time but yeah overall like my overall thought is yeah releasing music and having those 10 prominent dominant fans that are loyal and listening to your music and getting those 100,000 streams in within those 200 200 days that's pretty pretty you know pretty powerful you can do and that's what I'm focused on and that's where in the in the process of right now because when I'm looking at 4,000 streams f first week and I'm very thankful for the 4,000 streams first week, but I know that it's possible to do a lot better. And, that, you know, the overall goal is 1 million streams per month. And right now we're rolling almost halfway through February, and we are, and we're not even close to a million streams, but it could be possible. It could be that just one click. So it doesn't, it doesn't take a bunch of people. It just takes one click, a couple few people to be loyal with, and that's what I'm learning, but... The process is beautiful and I'm having fun with it and that's the overall big picture of the thing. So yeah, I appreciate you you joining, supporting the A-Rod Pack. Thanks for subscribing to the channel. Much love. Need me out on all music streaming platforms. Search A-Rod, A-R-Y-E or just click the link down below. Much love, A-Rod Pack.